Hey, Barnaby Dixon here. So this is my latest puppet. He's kind of like a, sort of like a bug man sort of thing. I'm not sure exactly what, but check out how he moves. So he's based very heavily on my Manu puppet design from over a year ago now in terms of his sort of his general shape and structure, but also these hands that can open and close and, and fingers that can point too. And this level of dexterity enables him to pick things up like that and uh, put him in there. He, uh, he's made from a very different material though. He's made from a kind of lightweight plastic, uh, which is very form fitting, very comfortable for me to use, very light. Uh, which I think it helps me get a lot more subtle movement out of him. So instead of like having him look alive through kind of a lot of uh, high energy stuff, which is fun to do as well, you can also make him look like he's kind of thinking almost, you know? Yeah. So a more obvious difference might be um, the fact that he has wings. So these, these can help him sort of jump a little bit or just kind of use them in an expressive, subtle way or just kind of fly around the space entirely, you know? Um, another thing that this one can do is uh, this one glows. So the other one could glow, but only under UV light. And I am actually using a UV light at the moment, but it's not necessary. Check out what happens when I turn the lights off. So check this out, isn't this wonderful? So I've been playing around with this for about a week and it's still blowing me away. Just like, just the fact that I can disappear completely into the background and just have him just occupy the space, just unhindered by me or my silly face. There we go. So you could have uh, all sorts of things going on in terms of uh, compositing as well. So I'm gonna do a bit of post-production stuff. There we go, so he's duplicated himself. Do a little dance. Or, uh, or sort of burst into like uh, a whole swarm of himself maybe. Yeah, it's really wonderful. Okay, so I'm planning to do some more videos with this guy in the coming weeks. Uh, next week, well, Friday, I'll be doing uh, a live thing in Bristol. So details of that can be found on my Twitter. I'll put details of any future live stuff I do there as well. Uh, below that is my Facebook and YouTube. And below that, if you're feeling super generous, is a link to my Patreon account where you can support me and the work that I'm doing, if you like. Um, but you can also support me in a more conventional way by simply uh, sharing this video with every single person that you know. Thanks very much. Do, do, do.